art. Yes, this is part two of the summer tin can pen pots or pen holders. And this one is all about the pineapple. Now, if you love Smiggles, I think these are Smiggles inspired and they're so cute and I love them to bits. And they're a great way to decorate or tidy up your room for summer or any time of the year if you love pineapples and melons. So today I'm gonna to show you how to make the pineapple. If you look up here, you can also see how to make the melon. But come on then, let's take a look and see how this cute little guy is made. Okay, to make the pineapple, you will need yellow paper, green, bits of white tape, a glue stick for the details, uh, pens and a ruler and of course some scissors. So let's start off with the yellow paper. Um, Coincidentally, it's almost the right size. This was already um, left over from another project, but I'm gonna just trim off, like literally, just a tiny little strip because I want it to fit that little bit better. And then we'll just double check that it fits. There we go, that's a nice fit. Now for the pineapple, we uh, need to do some crisscross lines. And I think the easiest way to do that is to use a ruler and a black pen. Make sure there's something underneath. I was off getting my scrap paper. I decided actually I want to use, um, oops, that's my pen falling, a brown pencil just to make it a bit more pineapple-y. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a whole set of crisscrosses, not too strong, but just to give it that sort of pineapple feeling. And I'm just gonna run it along my ruler like so. There we go, that looks quite good. I thought I might do it in half, but actually I think that's quite nice. So now we need to make our little pineapple face and it's gonna be very similar to our watermelon one. I'm gonna get a black pen, draw some eyes, a mouth, cut them out and we're gonna stick those on. We're also gonna need some pink cheeks if I can find the pink paper, but we'll have a look for that in a minute. There we go. Right, now all we need is the pineapple's leaves. So to do that, I'm gonna uh, fold this in half. Well, not in half, just fold it over. I'm gonna cut out four leaves at the same time. So again, fold this in this way. So these are just a leaf shape. So, and then I'm gonna glue them behind the face at about that height. So glue them all together first. straight, add a bit of glue over the top, glue it to the back, and now, <laughs> it's so sweet, now you need your sellotape. it to one side, bring it to the back of your tin so where the messy bit is, 
and then carefully roll it round. Now I need to just get my second tape ready. <laughs> Rolling off. So you've got this bit, second bit of tape ready. Carefully align it. Oh yeah, we need it to trim a little bit off. So I didn't, I forgot that bit. So my face isn't perfectly aligned. If you watch the um, melon one, you need to trim that off first and then have your, your face perfectly in the middle. But it's not, as you can see here, it's not a disaster. It just means that the tape isn't exactly at the back. Everything's falling down. Right, and here you go, finished. We have a watermelon and a pineapple tin can. Aren't they adorable? Now for the watermelon, just take a look up here in the iCards um, to see how to make that. The process is very similar, but I just thought I'd separate it out to make it easier. Um, as always, uh, you know, like, comment, share, add this to your playlist. Um, you know, remember to keep watching and keep making. And of course, we'd love to see you here again soon.